Yes, a young dad rolled his car several times while trying to get away from police. Inside this smashed car, his infant daughter. Today, we spoke to the family he crashed into right before he spun out of control. In a desperate attempt to get away from police. It was, just, it was horrifying. They say 20-year-old Antonio Barrera put his infant daughter in danger. Not only did he put that baby at risk, and, and his passengers, he put my passengers at risk, my daughter's life at risk. Desiree Gabaldon and her daughter Kiara. He scraped along the side, dented in my doors. Were hit by Barrera near Montgomery and Carlisle Monday night. According to the criminal complaint, the impact caused Barrera to lose control. His car fishtailed, slammed into this badly damaged guardrail, then went airborne. The SUV landed on its roof in the middle of the road. Gabaldon and her daughter ran to help. They saw two men were ejected from the SUV and a woman still in the back seat was clutching a loose car seat. And my heart sank to my stomach because there was a little baby. Luckily, police were already on scene. An officer tried to pull Barrera over minutes before when he noticed Barrera driving erratically with no lights on. But instead of stopping, he says Barrera floored it and the officer followed. After what felt like hours at the crash scene, Gabaldon finally heard the baby cry and saw her move. I was still shooken up, I was still upset, but that baby was the most important thing. The baby girl Barrera and the SUV's two other passengers were taken to UNMH. While there, Barrera said he didn't remember anything about the crash, but was worried about his daughter. Could happen to anybody, thank God it wasn't more than it was. At the time of the accident, Barrera had two felony warrants for failing to appear and also had a suspended license. He is charged with aggravated flinging and child abuse. Jess. All right, thank you, Brittany. No word tonight on how Barrera's baby is doing.